last year, November 11th. Uh, the reason why I started is because I feel like there was a need for young adults to promote their work and they also needed financial support while they were in college as well as workshops to teach them how to be professionals. And I wanted to teach young um, young adults as well as college students to really how to promote their um, business. So with the Art Society for Youth, um, not only are we throwing um, fundraising events, we're also promoting them through our magazine, Table B Magazine. We're also doing YouTube um, workshops and then as well as like workshops in different areas around the world just tell, basically telling them how to promote themselves. Cable B Magazine and what we'll be doing with that is showcasing local artists as well as artists around the world um, and we're just basically interviewing them, talking to them, showcasing their work because I feel like as an artist you have to have your work out there and it has to be an outlet where you can have your stuff out there. And we're focusing on people in their 20s because that's a vital age. That's when you're hungry, that's when you're excited, that's when you want to get your career going. And I feel like there needs to be more outlets for younger adults. Not somebody who's well established and they've been there, done that. We need somebody who's hungry, who's still at that level, who's going to make it. So that's what we're focusing on um, with Table B. In terms of the future, we plan on doing a lot of workshops um, as well as programs. And what we're doing with the programs is basically we are working with high school students and middle school students. And what we're going to do with them is teach them how to sew, teach them how to um, do a concept board, teach people how to play, a, play any instrument that they want. So that's what we're doing, the programs. And down the road, what we would love to have is a huge building, like a mecca of art, where you come and if you want to learn something, you could go. If you're an artist and you're like, I need a place to showcase my work, we'll have a gallery showing and we'll promote your work. We just want to have this huge place where people just go, learn, grow, and promote. That's what we want. Well, some of the challenges that I face is that people do not want to work with other people. They don't want to collab with anybody. And I feel like, or, or even teach anybody. And I feel like when it comes to that, like you should always be teaching, learning, growing. You know, when you know something, you teach. And when it comes to artists, they have this kind of thing like, it's just me, it's just me. I, nobody can tell me, but you know what? And I can't teach nobody. What I have learned throughout my life, if you're good at what you do and you teach somebody, you shouldn't worry about them coming above you. You kind of want that. You want to get that competitive spirit so you can be on your game and you can actually do better. 